never bothered about what could be coming Every day we danced and life was smiling We were young and drunk in love A few years later I have started thinking Hey hey y'all and welcome back, welcome if you're new my name is Tiffany. This is our small town life. Today, I am actually doing a collab with one of my good friends, Amanda, from His Bountiful Blessings. I'll make sure her channel is linked down below. She's one of the first friends that I made here on YouTube. Super sweet lady. Loves the Lord. Loves her family. I know if you like my content, you'll like hers. Make sure you go check her out. She actually just reached a 1,000 subscribers. Been cheering her on, and she reached that goal. She's doing a giveaway. I'm not going to give you all the details. I'm going to let her do that. Make sure you go watch her video to find out what she's doing. But we decided to do winter crock pot, a winter crock pot meal for you and share it. And so that's what we're going to be doing. If you're coming over from Amanda's channel or just finding me for the first time, my name is Tiffany. This is our small town life. We are a family of six, currently seven because we're living with my mother-in-law. We are in the process of moving. We're buying a double wide mobile home, putting it on a little piece of land that we've got, starting our own one acre homestead. We're sharing that whole journey with you. We'd love to have you as part of our family. Hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell, and just like that, you'll be one of us. So today I'm making Mississippi chicken. I started to say Mississippi pot roast. That's what I usually do, but we're going to change it up a little bit today. I've seen a couple people use different meat, kind of the same ingredients, but different meat. I think Shasta at a Vining Farmhouse and Marina at Fearfully Created. I've seen both of them, I'm pretty sure that's who it was, yeah, use different meat. One used chicken, one used pork chops. So today we're going to try it with chicken. We're going to share it with you. Uh, I've already got the crock pot out. My mother-in-law's crock pot is smaller than the one I usually use, so maybe we can make it work. But let's go get this stuff going. It's already after 9 o'clock, which is fine. Um, I really could have even probably waited just a little bit longer because we won't be eating it until supper tonight. But uh, anyway, we're going to go ahead and get it going. Let's go do that. Let's get everything out. Before I show you all the ingredients, I'm going to go ahead and get my chicken ready and get it in my crock pot. I'm just trimming it up and splitting it down the middle to make it thinner. Baby boy is in there talking, but let me show you what you need. This right here is four chicken breasts that I split in half to make eight. Uh, you could leave them whole if you wanted. That's just what I always do. And then I have a packet of ranch, a packet of brown gravy mix. I know some people use the au jus gravy mix, but I like this better. So this is what we do. You need one stick of butter. We like the country crop plant butter. The one made with olive oil is what we're using. And some pepperoncini peppers. You can put however many of these you want. I usually do six, seven, eight, whatever I'm feeling like. And I put a couple of tablespoons of this juice in there as well. I didn't get the salt and pepper out, but I'll also put a little bit of that on there. It's really easy, y'all. All you gotta do, sprinkle these on top of your chicken, put some salt and pepper, then open up this stick of butter, lay it right on top, put in your peppers and a little bit of pepper juice. And that's it, that's it. Then we'll cook it on low all day, six to eight hours on low. You could also do it on high for, I know, three, four hours. Just uh, check your temperature on your chicken to make sure that it's done. All right, let's go ahead and get all of this on our chicken and get it turned on. I do need to go ahead and get this going though because Justin called and he is gonna need us to take him. Woo, gonna make a mess. He's gonna need us to take him to his office, which is about an hour away. He was supposed to be getting a um, a car that had been worked on and driving it back, something that needed to be done for work. But apparently when he picked up the car, it was still, there were still problems with it. So he has to take it back to the shop, which means somehow he's got to get to work now because his whole plan was to take, to pick up that car for work and take it back the office if any of that makes sense what I'm saying is I need to get this done because the whole crew is gonna have to load up now and drive him to work which is about an hour away
these are the kind of dinners that I, <laughs> they're my favorite to make because it doesn't take me but just a minute to get it in the crock pot and then I really don't have to think about it anymore. I'll probably make some rice to go with this later. But other than that, I really don't have to think about it anymore. <laughs> just get it going and then it's ready for us. lids on got it on low we're just gonna let it go and tonight supper will be ready like i said we've never tried this with chicken before but i'm betting it's gonna be delicious we'll find out when we took justin to work i decided since we were out already i would take the kids to a trampoline park yesterday there was some We stopped at the P.O. Box and we had some more Christmas cards. We, we get so excited getting cards from you. Uh, this one is from my good friend, Susie. I love that. And then we have one from, you wanna see it? Yeah. And then we have one from Tracy. One from Wanda. Thank y'all so much. I can't wait to get home and put these on the door with our other cards. Speaking of which, it's time to head home and um, check on that chicken and get our rice finished up. Try it out. See how it is. Well, that was loud. Uh-oh. Did you drop your toy? I'll get it for you. Hang on just a second, baby. When we came in, this smelled so good and the chicken is just falling apart oh my goodness i'm so excited about that i'm gonna just fix this nor ross side to go with it and we're gonna have supper i'm gonna fix my plate i'll show you what it looks like i'll plate it up i did take a bite of it and it's good very very good don't forget that this video is a collab with my friend Amanda. Her video is going to be linked down in the description box. Somebody is over there laughing at me while I just sit in his high chair and he's just, just a giggling. He dropped his toy. I think he wants me to come pick it up for him. All right, I'm going to get the rice done. We're going to eat supper. Like I said, I'll show you the plate. Make sure you check out Amanda's video. If you're coming over from her channel, make sure you subscribe before you leave. Or if you're just new here and you haven't subscribed yet, hit that button. Join our crew. We'd love to have you. We'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all. Did you drop your toy? Did you drop it? Do you need mama to help? Let me help you, baby. There you go. There you go, Bubba. Full stop. Can't believe I live in your thoughts. I think about you all the time, morning, evening, and midnight. Such a wonderful day. Delight.